What are you doing? It's a portable containment field. Should protect me long enough to reach the condenser and trigger the manual self-destruct. Might be our only chance to close the rift. It's a long shot, but it's the best I got. Come on, you're talking crazy, Cole. We need to get out of here, let the military clean up their own fucking mess. They can't clean up their own fucking mess. So Jody, it looks like. Cole's yep. right. It's our only chance. Right? I always figured I'd die a hero. Of course you did, because you're a douchebag. Oh, I'm sorry. Alright, but this containment field only lasts one minute, so you have 60 seconds to get there. This elevator is going to take us to the 100th floor, and that's going to take about 10 minutes. Alright. How much time do we have after we've activated the self-destruct? The system was designed to be activated remotely. The explosion would be practically instantaneous. We're not coming back. Oh, shit. We don't really have a choice, do we? So I guess this is the last thing we're gonna do for Beyond Two Souls. Let's go. Fuck it. Fuck it. I gotta tap X. I gotta tap X. Oh, Cole. 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 Fuck. Jody, they're coming. Jody, no. Ah, my thumb. Come on. Tap X. Tap X. Yeah. Nathan is fucking crazy, dude. Oh. Aiden has done all he can. And like, we're looking for a way to shut this down. But. Don't you talk to me. I can't find them. I call them, but they don't come. Maybe it's because they don't recognize you anymore. Your anger has changed you. I miss them. I miss them so much. You're aiming a gun at me for. Let me pass, Nathan. The condenser must be destroyed. You know it's the only way. Why do I feel like if I didn't try to help him any other times, that this moment right here, he probably would have killed me? Oh, oh. I missed you. I missed you so much. You're the only one who can fix this, Jody. This is definitely the end of the game. Do it. Definitely the end. Do it for me. Holy fuck, dude. I was tapping X, dude. This, this is really intense. Fuck We're still monster. looking for the condenser, man. Keep moving. Am I 
containment field's not working. What? Are you sure? Just check the panel. Doctor, I'm telling you, it's not working. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I gotta think. I gotta think of something. Come on. He's gonna take his off. Yep. Oh, he's gonna give it to her. Emma, what are you doing? You stand the best chance of destroying the Black Sun. Just take this oh, and no, do it. Oh no, those things are gonna slaughter you. Take the damn belt and destroy the fucking condenser. Get out of here before I change my mind. No! Tap L1. I tapped the wrong button at first. Tap circle. Where the hobo clan at? No! Oh, they got both legs, dude! Ah! Uh, yo, I actually got out of that. Oh, not, don't remind me of these fuckers who tried to do this to her. Screw those guys. Tried to freaking rape her? That's messed up, dude. I'm sick and tired of your stories! This time, you're really gonna get it! Uh... Aiden is Jody's brother. My brother. And Jody killed Aiden in the wound. Oh no, 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 no. He just choked Still in the umbilical cord. Damn. Well, at least now we know who Aiden is. Can we see him? What does he look like? Don't tell me it's a fucking giant baby. Don't be a giant baby. We couldn't leave each other. Our souls were bound together. Can I see his damn face? I loved you. And hated you for years. You were a part of me. Oh boy. What is this? Uh, wait, 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 Aiden was on the black side of things, wasn't he? Because the sky was black when he disappeared. But we saw him on the blue. What are we doing? Is it really, is that really what this is or am I just... We're going to choose the wrong side. Can I get a preview? Other side. Another world. Coming the wind, the stars, the universe. Being with Aiden and those I've loved forever.
Oh, so I can just... Okay, I thought I was making the decision. What's over here? Living, feeling, being in love. I love you, Jody. Growing old. I love you. So many things I still have to do. This is life or death. This is a tough decision, isn't it? Die and be with people again or life keep going forward but what future does Jody have is the question doesn't really have much of a future does she because if you think about it everything that she's already done there's nothing left she has to give but except for Ryan unfinished business damn Ryan will understand so it's not like we're doing anything to him if I go to the left go beyond <sighs> they really gonna make me choose this dude alright I'm gonna flip a coin I'm gonna flip a coin. So heads, I got a nickel by the way. So heads is life, tails is beyond. It's tails. Okay. Jody! Jody! Jody, come here, wake up. Jody, wake up. Jody, wake up. Jody, wake up. I get any hate in the comment section because I chose to die. I swear. I'm not gonna get any hate though because no one ever comments on my videos. That's unfortunate. Refuse or postpone Ryan's declaration. Healed Cole. Ryan survived. Chose death. Damn. I am in the min minority when that one. Refused CIA money. I didn't want to. That was an accident. Convinced Dawkins. Took his own life. Huh. Shut down the black sun. Oh, yeah. Pretty much everybody did that one. <laughs> So I could have chosen to not do that. That's all I'm saying. There's a world out here. A whole universe of forests and lakes and mountains and rivers. It's all around us. You just have to listen carefully to hear its whisper. 
neither heaven nor hell. There's no god or devil. Just a place where we continue to exist after we die. My soul explores it endlessly, and I've still only seen a fragment of it. I can be everywhere and nowhere. I can dissolve into nothing or become whole again. I can merge my soul with others or, or be more alone than any human being has ever been. All this is possible merely by the force of my will. I continue to look through to your world. I watch over those I love. I'd like them to know I'm there, that I'm okay. To hold them in my arms one more time. Tell them how much I miss them. But I have to settle for being close by. Invisible. Transparent. No more than a fading memory. Hmm. Oh, Cole lived. So I guess pretty much everybody chose to live, I so I got to see a different ending at least. I know all the possibilities. I can see the darkness coming. I must stay a while longer. There is still a part to play. Before I can leave to discover what lies. Beyond. Oh, it's all the hobos. <laughs> Sometimes, I could spend hours staring into space, watching the images as they go by. I play over and over again, like a TV that's never turned off. I don't know why I'm seeing all this, but there's one thing I do know. It all really happened. When I'm alone, I listen to the voice inside my head. She talks to me. She says there are things I need to know. Sometimes I shut my eyes and it's as if I could fly. I can go through walls. I see beautiful colors around people. And I Why does she kind of look like Jody? That's kind of weird. Ever leaving my room. You know what I mean? Not to tell anyone. I'm really scared. Especially at night when I'm alone with the shadows. There are things moving in the darkness. Strange noises. Whispers in the dark. The voice says it's nothing. That it'll all go away. But she won't tell me what these things are. And I'm too scared to ask. I often have the same dream. Everything seems so real. 
sounds, the smells, the light. Deep down, I know it's not just a dream. It's like an echo, an echo of things to come. I must get ready. I know there's not much time. There's only one thing I can be sure of. I will never be alone again. So another game, huh? Next time, I'll kill everyone. Alan Page. I was so afraid I lost you. Willem Dafoe. I know who that is. How much time do we have after we activate the self destruct? We're not coming back. She's more than amazing. She's magnificent. Well, I like this game. It was a struggle at first trying to figure out the con uh, what is it called? Quick time events. But I mean that's me in any game basically. When there's something in it that like I don't normally do in another game that I play, I always end up fucking it up or something. I like the plot, I like being able to make different choices and stuff, but uh, overall, I had fun, and I mean, that's really what it comes down to, that was the goal, to have fun. So good game, uh, I don't know what I'm going to play next, maybe I'll play something for, that's free again, because, you know, don't have any uh, money to buy anything new right now. But fun game. Uh, if I had to rate it, I'd give it an 8.5 out of 10. Pretty good. In terms of its story and the gameplay. Um, a lot of action. I wasn't expecting there to be a lot of action. And I like that that was in the game because that's more my style. But yeah. You know, I wish the game was... Uh, a bit more humorous at times. It was very a very serious game, but with that being said, I wasn't able to like enjoy it as much, or you couldn't really hear me enjoying it as much as my commentary because there wasn't like anything like funny going on. It was always something serious. It was always something that you know. Oh man, what if your your life was like this? What would you do? You know. Overall, I enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoyed it too. So if you did, leave a like, and I'll see you guys for the next playthrough. We still got to finish uh, Hotline Miami.